Uh, gases given off during volcanic eruptions include uh, H2S and CS2. So I'm going to write the both equations here. Okay, um, just write it here. H2S, okay, plus oxygen will give you SO2 plus H2O. Okay, plus H2O. I guess if you need to balance this, uh, 3, 3 over 2. Okay, the other one, C, uh, CS2 plus oxygen will also give you carbon dioxide plus SO2. Alright, SO2, these two are the gases. So to balance, I put a 2 here. Alright, so I put a 3 here. Okay, it's all balanced really. Okay, so 40 cm3 of this sample and the ratio is 3 to 1, which means there's actually 30 cm3 of this and 10 cm3 of CS2. So in fact, I'm going to write down ICF, ICF, but all these are in terms of the volume. So um, this will be 30, let me see, uh, 30, and this is 10, all right? So um, I'm just going to find out, they say it was analyzed by com using 100 cm3 oxygen. In fact, in fact, um, H2S, right? H2S, if it reacts, it only requires 45 cm3 of oxygen. And for CS2, when it reacts, it only requires 30 cm3 of oxygen. All right. So why I say that? Uh, because the ratio is 1 to 3 and the ratio is 1 is to uh, 1.5. Is that? Okay. So actually by right, only how much oxygen will be used up? There will only be, let's check, there are only 75 cm3 of oxygen used. All right. Which means uh, there will be a 25 cm3 of oxygen remaining all right remaining because you used up uh, you, you started 100 so there'll be 25 cm cube remaining okay so um, let's see how much uh, sulfur dioxide is being produced so you can see from here um, uh, 1 is to 1 right so this is like minus 30 this will be plus 30 and this is 30 okay so I put 30 over here first I circle Okay, uh, 0, 0. So if I put minus 10, minus 30, right? this is plus 10. I'm just using the more ratio. I hope you can see uh, 1 is to 3 is to 1 is to 2. So the change always follows the more ratio. Minus 10, minus 30, plus 10. And this one plus 20. Okay, so very quickly, I'm just going to circle. Okay, all the acidic gases. So um, the volume of gas remaining was treated with excess sodium hydroxide and the volume of gas measured again okay given that uh, so what's the volume of gas mixture after burning after burning there'll be 25 cm cube of oxygen remaining but how much are the as other acidic gases that's present so2 co2 and this so2 over here so you notice there's actually 60 cm cube of co2 and so2 all together right so the amount of gases remaining should be 85 so i'm going to put out 85 over here so volume of gas after adding sodium hydroxide sodium hydroxide is a is a base it will absorb all the acidic gases absorb all the acidic gases so leaving only the oxygen behind so the volume of gas mixture after adding sodium hydroxide has to be uh, 25 okay so the answer is c4 for this